I would say 100% skateboarding runs in the family. I don't know how. It's, it's got to be from my dad's side, but uh, our connection to skateboarding goes deep. You know, it's like it's literally all I know. And you got to think when I started skating, Shane was two years younger than me, so he even started skating before I did. Technically, you know. Ryan's always set the bar. Everything that we've ever gotten into, it's we've always, you know, aspired to try to be up there in the top rankings of it. So it's always been real competitive. It keeps things fun, keeps things fresh. There's no way that the connection between all of us and skateboarding will ever change. It's embedded in like this family for sure. You know, skateboarding is our lives. Like Sheckler, Shecklers are skateboarders. It's the best thing in the world to like be able to wake up, know you can call both your brothers and actually go have a sick session. And you know it's blood, so it's it means something different. Kane's first. Were you trying to pressure flip? No, no, no. It's this new one I got. Just wait. This new one. I don't know. I'm trying to I'm trying to figure out what you're trying. Just don't think about it. Just let it happen when it happens. All right, let this happen then. When'd you learn that one? Like, honestly, the other day. No way, dude. Sick. I was gonna say, oh, I got it, but then I didn't want to fall. That kind of caught me by surprise. Pleasant, like, pleasant surprise. Ryan is um, the oldest. Shane's the middle. I'm the youngest. Mom and dad, you're kind of unorthodox, not the normal family. This rail turned out a lot bigger than I originally had designed it. I knew it did. I so knew it did, but it's so... It's, it's tight, like, but yeah, no, it's so good. Kane's, what, 16 now? And he was into everything that me and Shane were into. It was always, you know, kind of trying to do things that his brothers didn't do, you know? And so he would, like, Kane got a razor, and I remember grabbing the razor, and I threw it in the bushes, and, you know, he threw a fit. He was six years old, and I was like, we don't razor, you know? Skateboarding, kind of forced skateboarding on Kane, I think, but look at him now, man, he loves it. He's a natural. You didn't touch, you didn't even pinch, you just, you rode it. Really? Yeah. So it was lame. It wasn't lame. That takes skill. <laughs> Growing up in San Clemente has been just an absolute treat. Uh, I feel spoiled from it. Parents uh, just kind of, you know, showed us the showed us the good ropes of skateboarding, surfing, some motocross, BMX. We shot everything all right here in town, so. Been, it's been a pleasure. The skate park's kind of the mecca of the skate scene, I guess you could say, but it's for sure more of a surf environment in San Clemente, the little surf town by the beach. It's crazy having this park here, you know, it's, it's San Clemente Park. This park's been around now, say 14 or 15 years. So I started skating this park. This was the first park that was close to me. I've been there since the day it opened when I was 12 years old, and we skated there every single day. And the park, you know, it's, it's not that crazy and it's not that great, but for me, it was everything. It was everything we needed. And it, it was so difficult to skate because the rails were small and not right, and everything kind of ran into everything else. And you just had to really learn. It was really tricky, so it tricked your mind into learning how to skate all of these obstacles and tie them all together. And I think that's why I really like skating contests and like putting runs together because of San Clemente Park. I learned how to do them there, and it just became, that's how I skated. I just like linking tricks together. Like this actually used to really be like, we consider this a, a big handrail and a, and a hubba and stairs. Like 
you know, this is where I learned tricks. Like, I learned tricks on this, on this rail and this park and, like, have my brothers come here and skate with them here and just have them ripping, like, watching Shang skate completely different than Kane and then I kind of skate different from both of them. It's like, but we all mesh together and we all skate and have so much fun, so, I don't know. Blessed to have San Clemente Park. Um, it's not the best park, but I love it, so it's good. Yeah, Ryan kind of paved the way with the skateboarding, and I, you know I saw how much fun he was having with it. And I think I was you know four or five years old, so that was when I started getting on a board too. And we kind of just learned you know skating together, competing with each other, trying to do who could do things first, first airs, first grinds. You know, it was just fun. You know, me and Shane, uh, we're we're the closest you could possibly be. You know, that's that's my my best friend, and uh, it's just crazy watching him grow up. You know, we skated contests our whole lives together, you know? It was like, it was a brother thing, you know? Anything I did, Shane would do. And the one thing that always was there was skateboarding, and we'd always fall back to that because that was the most fun we have. You know, that's still to this day. We still skate, we still hang out and kick it all the time. And, you know, skateboarding is our lives. Like, Sheckler, Shecklers are skateboarders. It's created such a blessing of a life for me and my family, and you know, it's just a trip, man. Skateboarding is everything.